Pete the Cat and the Missing Cupcakes. Pete and Gus were as busy as could be. They were getting ready for the cupcake party. It started at three. They have milk and flour. They were making cupcakes for everyone. Pete and Gus counted them just for fun. They had 10 when they were done. Some of the cupcakes were gone. Oh no, oh no. They were sure they had been 10. Pete said, maybe we need to count again. They counted the cupcakes lined up straight. Now there were only eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looked like someone had taken two. But who? But Pete and Gus did not know what to do. Just then, they found a clue. <gasps> Look at those. There's a clue. There's two cupcake wrappers. Gus said, Look what I have found. Sprinkles on the ground. I bet it was Squirrel. She loves sprinkles. Squirrel said, It wasn't me. It couldn't be. I've been at the spelling bee. Uh-oh, more cupcakes are missing. Come and see. This was too weird. Two more cupcakes had disappeared. Now there were only six. Someone must be playing tricks. But who? Pete and Gus did not know what to do. One, two, three... Four, five, six. Just then, they found another clue. Oh, look. There's some footprints. Pete said, I bet it was Alligator. He loves to eat. Alligator said, it wasn't me. It couldn't be. I've been learning my ABCs. Uh-oh, more cupcakes are missing. Come and see. Now there were only four. Someone had taken two more. But who? One, two, three, four. Pete and Gus did not know what to do. Just then, they found another clue. I bet it was Turtle, said Pete. I know Turtle loves sweets. Oh, look, they found a ladder. Turtle said, it wasn't me. It couldn't be. I've been swimming in the sea. Uh-oh, more cupcakes are missing. Come see. <gasps> look. There's someone in the mirror, I mean, in the window. What on earth was going on? All the cupcakes were now gone. There's no cupcakes left. Pete and Gus did not know what to do. They started looking for another clue. Look, there's a cupcake wrapper and some footprints and some sprinkles and a cupcake wrapper and some footprints and a cupcake wrapper and some sprinkles. They found Grumpy Toad with icing on his face. Pete and Gus have solved the case. I am so sorry it was me. 
I could not stop with just one. I ate and ate till there were none. And look, he's got all the cupcake wrappers in front of him. Everyone agreed. Grumpy Toad would have to miss the fun. He could not come after what he had done. Pete said, but wait, Grumpy Toad made a mistake. This is true. Let's give him a second chance. That's what friends do. So Pete told Grumpy Toad that they would give him another chance. He was so excited, he did a happy dance. Look, he's dancing. The night of the party was so much fun. Grumpy Toad bought more than enough cupcakes for everyone. Look, he made cupcakes. And it said, Pete the Cat's Cupcake Party. The end.